Beast and Gentlemen. Today we are back in another episode of Feed the Beast, and today in this episode, I've been doing some Thumbcraft research, and we have researched a lot of items, which is quite a bit of items. So, I want to get started with some like arcane boar stuff. So, um, I unlocked the pickaxe of core. So we're gonna go ahead and make one of those this episode, and we're also gonna need a wand of fire this episode. And I'm thinking I'm g we're gonna research, and we're gonna get ourselves a pretty beast armor set of Thomcraft armor. So, um, in order to do that, we're gonna first need to research some goggles of revealing. So, I have a little thing set up over here so I can see the aspects of what we're gonna need. So we're gonna need some leather. I'm just gonna kind of show you guys how I research stuff because it's kind of I know I was like a complete noob to this and now I have all this research and stuff done and you guys probably wondering how and why and stuff but yeah we're gonna need some paper for a different aspect so let's grab about 20 it's like we go we got some paper and this has the aspect that we need um cognito and this one has the big michelin man guys what i think of <laughs> so we have that and then we're gonna need some precancy which is magic which we can get from we can get that from blaze rods i believe we can get precantio yep we can get precantio and that should be pretty cool and then we're also going to need some vism which we can get from glowstone Glestone, and then we can get some Utadio. So we're gonna need some Utadio as well. <laughs> okay, so we get this from Nether Warts, Mossy Cobblestone, or Wisp Essence. So let's see how many Nether Warts we have. We have zero Nether Warts. All right, well let's go find some Nether Warts. Uh, yeah, let's go find some Nether Warts. You know what? Actually, no. Let's trade on some U Matter for it, because U Matter trading is always a good way to go. Yep. Okay. So let's grab some UU, -U. and I also need to wire up a big like system so I can craft over there. Uh, 32 for two stacks of quartz. Let's do that. Um, no, 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 nether wart. Nether, nether warts. All right. Oops. Nether wart. All right. So I have two stacks of U, and then you can have that. Alrighty. So now that we have all that, um, we basically can just go and just try and research some of this stuff okay so let's go over here to our research table and we have paper in here so then we throw an aspect like this in here and we're gonna want this mutate you so let's start researching this and let's use cursory for now and we're gonna see that it doesn't have that but it does have mutate you so we're hoping that whatever this whatever this researching is it could be something random with mutate you or not so it's still an unknown theory so if we research this and we're gonna want this tutanim Let's see if this has any tutanim in it, what we're wanting. Yes, it does. So I'm hoping we're on the right track to goggles of revealing. Yes, we are. So when these are on the outside, they have like 100%, then that's cool. Then we're going to need some vism. So we're going to do a cursory, just to make sure that the aspect is there. And then we can go through or just power through the aspect until it's at the edge. There we go. And then we're going to need some blaze rods for the precantio. All right, let's get that all the way to the edge. Come on, you can do it. There we go, and then we'll notice that the last aspect is the cognito, and then go like that. So you're all the way, there we go, and now we have a discovery, goggles are revealing, awesome, awesome. So if you read this, and you can right click it, and now if we go back into our Thalmanomicon, we have goggles of revealing that we can make with an infusion altar. So we're going to need probably upgrade our wand almost sometime in the near future here, if I figure out how. Um, yeah, we're probably going to need to do that in the future here. Yep. Okay. So, so limited amount of magical. Uh, just like carrying. Oh, it'll slowly recharge itself. So this one, I believe, can only carry 50 V, and we're gonna need what is that? 60 for the goggles of revealing. So yeah, we're gonna need 60. Yeah. Okay. So. All right. So we're gonna need 60 V for this. So let me just. Uh, okay. Um, um, to up I'm still learning this too, Thomcraft and stuff like that, so I'm not going to be all good with everything in Thomcraft. I basically know the gist of it, but I don't really kind of sort of know. <laughs> okay. So I believe I can make different wands. So I have to one crafted. I'll just get the exact same. So if I use... 
the wand of adept. Okay, so I'm gonna want the wand of adept. Okay. So I'm gonna need an infusion altar for this. So I'm gonna need the. Okay, so we're gonna need to start making with an infusion altar. So we unlock this magical building blocks. And I did all this legit with all resource and everything like that. So we're gonna need to get some of that. And we're gonna know in order to make this arcane stone brick thing. So. Now, this isn't really a good area to do any of this stuff at all. It's like a horrible area to do it, but I guess we're just going to sit over here anyway. Okay, so we are going to need to get some thaumium, which I don't know if we have any thaumium or not. Um, we possibly do. Okay, so we're going to need some thaumium. So eight heat metallum and four percantio. Got percantio. I need some metallum. All right. So it'd be so useful to have like the enemy turn access or crafting terminal terminal or whatever over there. So, but yeah. Okay. So how much how much of this are we gonna need? Magical building block, arcane stone block. Okay. So we get eight. So we're gonna need four thaumium. And in order to get thaumium, we get so we're gonna need thirty two metallum and sixteen that. So we're gonna need thirty two metallum. So it's four of these in here. One, two, three, four. And then, how many of these did we say? So we need 16. So we decided two. Okay, so it's two piece. So that's two is one, right? So we're gonna need eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we right click with a wand and we got four thaumium ingots. Alright, so now that we have the thaumium, um, we're gonna need some stone bricks as well. Stone bricks, alright, there we go. And then we go into our infusion, whatever it's called. We go like that. And then we go like that. Thaumium in the corners. Then we throw a wand in as well. There's a wand that this goes in here. And we get eight arcane bricks, or ar ar arcane stone blocks. Okay, so now we're going to want to set this infusion altar somewhere near here. So I'm thinking that we get rid of this lava thing over here. So I'm thinking. Alright, so let's do that and then let's do that. There we go. So that's going to slowly dissipate all of the lava out of there. Hold on, slow. It's going to quickly dissipate. Alright, so now we can do this, break all the glass, and then we can probably put our infusion altar in this corner here, which is what I'm thinking. So I think that should look pretty nice after we put an infusion altar over here, over in this corner. Everything should look, it should, should look pretty good, but you never know, man. You never know, you never know. All right, so can I place the black here, please? There we go. All right, that, 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 and badoo. Okay, so now I'm thinking we just place it right here. Oops, nope. Here, and then, yeah. Okay, and actually, you know what? I'm gonna put this into the ground, kind of like put yeah, put it in the ground. Some, I think that'll look a little nicer. Is there anything else additional information we're gonna need to know about this? Like it has to be so close to a crucible or something like that. All right, the infusion object can be used to form crafting. Normal workbench can infusion object great source of that crucible is a good example of one such source. After placing the components, I'll take get an idea of what the aspects are. So with those aspects, we can craft them. A single da, 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 da. I come from a single source. If you cannot draw aspect from multiple sources, which you require a mount. Okay. So they should know that once the aspects are drawn from it, the remaining aspects might be split into aura as flocks. Okay. Shift clicking to create multiples of an item will cause spillage of an end creation product. Okay. So I believe them if you go like that. Hey, cool. Alright, so this should recharge. And now we have the thing. Okay. So I think we might need another wand of the apprentice to make another to make an upgraded wand, is what I'm thinking. Okay. <coughs> so Yeah, so if we go into our No, where is it? Unified Thumb Theory. Okay, yep, so this is what we're gonna need. So, we're going to need 16 Precantio and 15 V. So, do I have any V? This is just a bunch of, a bunch of research notes that kind of, like, didn't work out. 
I didn't get what I wanted and stuff like that, so I just kind of threw him in that chest there. And you're gonna feel that there. Get that boiling up again. Okay, so let's grab another shard and a golden nugget. Golden nugget. And let's grab a stick and a shard. I don't have any sticks. Okay, wow. Alright. Okay, here's some wood. Wood for a stick. Alright, there we go like that. Just make a stack of that. Okay. So then, go like this, and then this, and then we're going to need a shard of some sort. Um, we have a lot more air shards, so I'm just going to get an air shard. Okay, so now we have another wand of the apprentice. And we're going to use this wand to make another wand, basically. So, okay. So we're going to put this wand in here. And that should recharge and get 50 V for us, which we're going to need. Awesome. So, oh, that's kind of cool. It's like floating. All right, so we're going to need for this infusion here. What did that say? Going to need, yeah. Okay, so we're going to need 16 Percantio. Air shard, fire shard, earth shard, and water shard. So we're gonna need an. Sh 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 let's just search up shard. So we're gonna need an air shard, a fire shard, an earth shard, and what else? Um, a shard and a water shard, right? Yeah, I think that's it. Air shard, fire shard, earth shard, water shard. Air shard, fire shard, air shard. Okay. So then we go back over here, and then we should throw. We need 16. So we're going to throw eight of these in this boiler here. Oops. Three, four, five, six. Oops. What, what does this say? How do I read you? <laughs> How do I read what's inside the crucible? I'm just going to throw five in there. Okay. So that's 50 V. And this has 50 V as well. Okay, so then we go water. Uh, earth. Fire. And this, right? Right. Fire, then earth. Okay, so it's fire shard, then earth shard. Okay, and then we go like this and go like that. Alright, so now that we have our upgraded wand of the adept. Then we can, that wand can just stay in there, I guess. That can be kind of our cool at crafting wand or whatever. Alright, so now that was actually the perfect amount of Percantio. Okay, so now we can go ahead and make, what do we want to make? Oops. Uh, we want to make these goggles of revealing. Okay, so this requires 60 V, right? So in the infusion altar, that requires 8 Percantio. Alright. So let's just go like that and place this new wand in there. Like that, and this one can go in here. Oops, that catches on fire a lot, actually. Okay. So, we're gonna need... This can just go in here as well. Okay. So, we need... Four leather, two gold, and two of those things. So, we're gonna need... Four leather... Ch -ch 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 -ch. Leather... One, two, three, four... Uh, two gold... Gold... Okay. And then... We should get, what else do we need? Oops. Um, okay, so we're gonna need two thermometers. Thermometers. Alright, so we're gonna need four, so we're gonna need eight gold and two water shards. Gold, so we're gonna need eight more gold, yep. Yep, I did do that. Gold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and two water shards. And then we should be pretty well set. Water shards, okay. Alright, so now we go back in here, and we should be able to just go, I'm going to grab this wand here. I'm going to see a fire somewhere, okay, no. So I'm just going to grab this wand of the apprentice here and just throw that in there. Okay, so, one, two, three. Okay, so then how did it go? believe it was, okay. So it's like that, and that in the middle. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And then these two in the middle here. We got two thermometers. Cool. So then you can like search stuff through it, I guess. Alright, so now we have two thermometers. And then we have those. And then we can go on the infusion altar. Then we go like that, and that, and then that, and that. And then that, that, that. Okay, so we're gonna need eight mutadio. How do we get mutadio again? Isn't it one of these things? 
Uh, leather, okay. So we got one of those on each. So we're gonna need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we got the eight mutadio. We're gonna need eight vism. Okay. So we're gonna need three of those. One, two, three. And then how much magic are we gonna need? Eight Precantio, okay. So, four of these. One, two, three, four. Now we should be able to go ahead and grab our goggles of revoil. Okay, we didn't get our mutatio. Uh, no, I need my mutatio. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <coughs> That should, it's not, oh, oh, that's Flux. Um, is there a better way to get Mutadio? Okay, let's see if there is. Ah, uh, that's not Mutadio, is it? Okay, nope, my bad, my bad. Alright, what, what, what did we get? This, that's what we needed. Eight of these, okay. Oops. Ouch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we should be able to craft these. Awesome. Okay, and then that's emptied. Cool. Alright, so now we have goggles of the revealing. Then if we go like that, we should be able to reveal stuff, if you will. Yep. Okay, now we can reveal stuff. So in the next episode, I'm thinking that we work on getting another pair of like full Thaumcraft armors. You can see in here, we can make some Thaumaturges stuff. So I'm thinking we do that, and that's going to be pretty cool. So I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to hit that like button down below. And if you really enjoyed it, maybe even subscribe, because that'd be awesome. Then you'd be able to see all the new videos that I post, and everything cool and stuff like that. So I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Possibly a live stream on Monday, that's what I'm thinking, or probably not even Sunday. So just probably a live stream on Monday, and I will see you guys later. Adios, guys.